see the book of Deuteronomy, yeah, chapter 6 and verse 12. And it reads, here we are. Actually, you know what? I think it is. Yeah, Deuteronomy 5 and verse 12. It says, Keep the Sabbath day to sanctify it as the Lord thy God hath commanded thee. So the Bible says one of the commandments, even in the Ten Commandments, was to keep the Sabbath day and to make it holy. Alright? So that was a commandment. Yeah? So, do you guys keep the Sabbath day holy? What do you mean by Sabbath day holy? What do I mean by keeping it holy? Yeah. Okay, I'll show you what I mean by keeping it holy, yeah? So the Bible says here in verse 13, Six days shalt thou labor and do all thy work, for the seventh day is the Sabbath of the Lord thy God. In it thou shalt not do any work, thou nor thy son, nor thy daughter, nor thy manservant, nor thy maidservant, nor thy ox. You all right, you can hear that, yeah? Yeah, yeah. I mean. All right, nor, nor thine ass, nor any of thy cattle, nor thy stranger that is within thy gates, but thy manservant and thy maidservant may rest as well as thou. So the scripture says we keep it holy by not working on the Sabbath. We keep it holy by not shopping on the Sabbath day, right? Were you aware of that? So when is the Sabbath? When is the Sabbath day, yeah? I'll show you. So in the Bible it tells you this real quick, yeah? So to understand what the Sabbath day is, Jeremiah chapter 6. Jeremiah chapter 6 and verse 16, yeah? Alright, it says, Thus saith the Lord, stand ye in the ways, and see, and ask for the old paths, wherein is the good way, and walk therein, and ye shall find rest for your souls. And they said, we will not walk therein. So the Bible says, we need to ask for the old paths. So if you want to know what day the Sabbath is, you have to see what day they were keeping the Sabbath in the time of Jesus. So now we have historical record of when the Sabbath was originally kept by the Israelites, and I can show you that, what day of the week it was. And I've got this book here that goes into the history of it. But before I show you what day the Sabbath was, I just want to ask you, what day would you say the Sabbath is? Because you are people that say, you know, you keep God's commandments. So you guys must be keeping the Sabbath if you keep it. So what day do you keep as the Sabbath then? Sunday. Sunday. You keep, Sunday is the Sabbath. Okay. And where do you think we got Sunday from? Did we get Sunday as being God's Sabbath? Or is this what man has given us that day? I believe every day is Sabbath. You think every day is the Sabbath? Yes. What would you say? You think every day is the Sabbath? Yes, sanctify God every day. So yeah, we sanctify God every, every day. day. Every day God is holy. But the thing yeah. about the Sabbath day, brother, yeah, check it out, yeah? This is why every day can't be the Sabbath day, real quick. So in the book of Genesis, yeah, chapter 2 and verse 3, it says, And God blessed the seventh day, and sanctified it because that in it he had rested from all his work which God created and made. So the Bible says, the Bible says that God had blessed the Sabbath day. That's what made it sanctified. So where in the Bible does it say that God blessed every single day? Does it say that? Does the Bible say God blessed every day? He blessed one day. Okay. So every day can't be the Sabbath because every day wasn't blessed. Now that word sanctified means to make holy. Now let me ask you a question, brother. How do you make something holy? What makes something holy? If every day is holy, if every day is the Sabbath day, what makes it holy? What makes it holy? Because God said so that everything is created, everything is blessed. You should be created. Mm. Everything is blessed. And God blessed them. And God blessed them. And God blessed them. And God blessed them. Mm. From the first day to the last day. So every the single day was sanctified, day. yeah? Yeah, every day is sanctified. Okay. Please, what do we look at it now? So, so here, here's the last verse I'm going to show you, just to show you that that understanding isn't quite right, so hopefully I can help you with that one, yeah? So here's what makes something holy according to the Bible, yeah? Leviticus chapter 20 and verse 26, yeah? And it tells you, And ye shall be holy unto me, for I, the Lord, am holy, and have severed you from other people, that ye should be mine. So what that shows you is that what makes something holy is if it's been severed from other things, if it's separate. So what made the Sabbath day holy was that it's the only day that God didn't work. God didn't, God worked the other days, so the other days weren't holy. Thank you bro. Alright bro, hopefully you know, you understood what I said yeah, because yeah, what yeah. you said was wrong. And if you don't follow what I've said, 
You're not gonna be able to keep the commandments. Every day is not holy, brother. Thank you. So hopefully you've received that. God bless you. Take care. All the best. All right. Praise the most high, yeah? So check this out, yeah? This is um, the book of Proverbs, chapter 3 and verse 5. And I feel like, you know, for that brother right there that came over, you know, I feel like it's... It applies to him, yeah? <laughs> Proverbs chapter 3 and verse 5. Trust in the Lord with all thine heart and lean not unto thine own understanding. So he was kind of just coming out with his own freestyle understanding, saying that every day is holy. A lot of people do that, man. And he was saying that because every day was good. She said every day was blessed. Excuse me, you believe in the Bible, sister? You believe in the Bible? You believe in the Bible, sis? Yeah, what about the Bible right here? You got a word for the preacher? You got a minute? Okay. So, here we go. Yeah. You know, we're not meant to lean on our own understanding, okay? And we can't come up with our own like it tells you in the book of... Um, here we go. Second Peter chapter 1 and verse 20. We can't have our own private interpretation of saying, like, every day is the Sabbath. If every day was the Sabbath and sanctified, no day would be sanctified because for something to be sanctified, it means it's separate. So if every single day is sanctified, no day is separate. It's all equally the same, nothing is holy, okay? So yeah, that's the problem with um, many people that read the Bible. If they draw their own conclusions rather than just reading what the Bible says. You believe in the Bible? Uh, I don't know. Yeah, you got a minute for God's word? I can show you something in there. All right. All right, here we go. Second Peter 1 and 20. Knowing this first, that no prophecy of the scripture is of any private interpretation. You can't just take out your own meaning and say every day is the Sabbath. You've got to go with what the Bible says. You got a minute for God's word, sisters? Uh, sorry. Oh, okay. All right. You got a minute for the word of God? You got a minute for God's word? No? All right. You believe in the Bible, sister? All right. You got a minute for God's word? All right then. So yeah, man. People. <laughs> uh, let's see, let's see, let's see. What can we even uh, bring out on this one? John chapter three. You got a minute for God's word? All right. Right? Yeah, you're right. Yeah, good, man. Yeah, man. All right, John chapter three. I'm good, nice here. Yo, blood. Yeah. You know the kid in the corner. Do you know it? Do you actually know it? Why are you interfering in my problems? Look, check it. You know, back in the day, if I fuck with neighbor shit or start fucking about it, I get clapped up. Now these fucking sand niggas don't like black people. Remember, they're the ones. You know when you hear about people taking Negroes into slavery? Yeah, I don't want to right, slavery. right. Yeah. He's from that very stock. Please, now you please. defending yeah, that yeah. shit. Go you're on. defending that shit. Now check, let me show you ethnics. You're while you're doing your little fucking thing here, I'm stood over there. You're not you're not watching because look, you come round there to fuck with people, yeah? Right? No, look, check it. I don't give a fuck. Now at the end of the day, right? I'm stood down there. This cunt's kicking my fucking bike. Yeah. Now, at the end of the day, he's not telling the child. The kid, he's kicking me bike. Now, look, check it. I thought the wind blew me bike over one day. It was the fucking kid. Now, he's not telling his bastard child, yeah? Don't fuck with next people's shit. You understand what I'm saying? Because they don't give a fuck, but your brain don't seem to want to recognise that. Bro, it's good to be gracious. No, look, look the fuck the gracious, mate, because look. Kids, you understand look, that. Look, look, check it, look, look check it. it. But he should have got clapped up. Is that the told not to do it? Right, course, look, but you're just... dealing with people who don't have no ethnics. They don't have no ethnics for those blood, and you're rolling with it. You remind me of that black guy who, 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 who dates so as a kid to a white bird and now you want to go on stink. It's like, look check, look, check it. I don't give a fuck what you're married to, blood. But at the end of the day, it's like, you have a mental problem. 
Mm. You have a mental problem now. You coming out here telling me I've got the mental problem. You niggas have got mental problems. No, then. No, 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 no. Now check. When the sand nigga fucks with me and he goes home, because he explained to his wife. In my belief, the Bible says blessed. Belief. What belief is for children. Where, where, where belief, belief is for children. For children. No, no, I've got a belief, bro. In my belief, the Bible says blessed are the peacemakers, innit? I've seen you have a problem with a guy. I was just trying to, you know, cause peace, bro. No, I was look, trying to check it. Between. Don't I don't realize what I'm down, no, bro. Check it. Don't was screaming at look, the guy that was no need Look, it. check it. Don't interfere yeah, with my it. shit, because look, these cunts hate me as it is. Cause I'm full of energy, yeah? You ain't got that energy, fuck no. you, I don't give a fuck. Mm. You wanna fucking cause problems? My mother and father were this big, this big, yeah? So they give birth, I'm the tenth nigga. Yeah. I ain't listening to no fuckeries. And another no, thing, no, listen, 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 no listen. Was you, you there when them cunts killed my mother in 2020? I don't know anything about any of that, bro. Right then, don't, I'm telling you, when you see me warring with any cunt out here, I'm begging you, don't interfere, cause look, I will turn the aggression on you and it'll get nasty. Now look, check it, blood. I want to get to yard after I've got my degree. I don't want to be getting locked up for some degenerate fuck who doesn't know no ethnics. Now look, check it. When you see me warring with any cunt out there, you get involved, I'm going to get the chopper out. Oh, look, check it. I told you once, when you see me warring with people because they're being fuckhead, don't get involved. All right, we'll leave it at that, bro, yeah? Right, because look, right. if you come near me again when I'm fucking with, when someone's fucked with me, look, check it. You see that All shit right, in there? All right. Yeah, I'll hurt you, yeah, mate. Jeez. Mmm.